2 at 11, a robbery of a Dayton home where the homeowner thought he was being a good Samaritan, helping a woman in need. It happened on Tuttle Avenue off Smithville Road. Robert Lowry explains why you should always be careful before you open that door. He said, there's a hundred and forty some dollar comb. <laughs> That's what James Hill got in return after opening his home to a stranger. All it cost him was his wallet, a credit card, and more than a hundred dollars in cash. I opened the door and there was this woman there, you know. And she, first she said that uh, she had the wrong apartment. And I says, well, it's okay, you know, because it's happened before. Hill said she asked to use the phone and invited her into his apartment. That is when he says she took advantage of his kindness. And I went over there and got the phone, and she was sitting there in, the, in that chair right there in the kitchen. And I had my billfold right here. I wasn't paying no attention, you know. But when she got done, she handed me the phone back. And then I brought the phone back in here and put it back on the receiver. And I, in that time, she must have got it. Once he realized it was stolen, Hill searched his neighborhood. He said nobody knew who the woman was. Fortunately, a neighbor found his wallet in a yard, returning it to Hill. It's an act of good he never expected would turn bad. Now he says he'll be more cautious, opening his home to strangers. I just never thought, but I will from now on. A police report describes that woman as a 20-year-old white female. Hill said she was wearing blue jeans and a tank top. Call police if you have any further information.